take two. Um, as the title says, my success is my responsibility. It ain't yours. It ain't the man down the street. It ain't my kids. It's mine. And everybody has a different outlook of what they feel success is. And I'm not talking billions in the bank. I'm not even talking millions in the bank. That isn't always success. Maybe having a little extra free time with your family and being able to stay at home. Uh, maybe buying Chinese one night because the family wants Chinese. Maybe it's pay the water bill because it's due and you don't get paid for a week. Maybe it's buying a Nintendo Switch because you absolutely want one down here in your own space. Success is different for everybody. Some people find a day off, lay back in a recliner, reading all day is successful. Watching Netflix all day, that's what they feel is success. To me, success is a little more freedom to do the things I want to do. Pay for things that are not only needed but wanted, like my Switch, or going painting with some friends, or paying a bill that came due before you realized it. Whatever it is, it is your responsibility, just like mine is my responsibility. So I do promote what I do. I love what I do. I use the products. Scroll back in my feed. You'll see tons of them. My nails already have to be painted again. Look at that. They're growing. My hair is absolutely amazing right now, although I want to get it cut. It's amazing. It feels good. It's growing. It's a little thicker. Um, I mean, this is my hair. <laughs> it's there, but little. So, yes, I promote things that I love and I use. My skin looks so much better. Guys, I'm 55. I don't want to feel 55, but I am 55. And sometimes my body says, hey, you're 55. But at the same time, doesn't mean I have to look horrible or feel horrible. I have IBS. Had it forever. $300 after insurance for the meds. No. No. So I do some of my products. And I go every day and it helps. These are the things to me that are, that are successful to me. I am feeling better. I am doing things. I'm getting outside. Maybe it's just Sadie over there. See her right there? She's sleeping. Getting a couple new toys. It's, it's the little things that really matter to me. Always happen that way. So instead of like coming into my DMs and telling me that I shouldn't be doing what I'm doing, that it's a scam. Dude, you work in the biggest pyramid in the world. Corporate America. So don't come into my DMs and tell me that that's what I am, because it's not. I do do social retail, and I love it. It gives me a little bit of income. It helps people. The products are award-winning, amazing patented products. I can't, you know, there's there's no, no loss. There's no nothing, you know? So instead of trying to tear somebody down for what they do, why don't you build them up? No matter what it is that they do, build them up. If we spent more time building others up, and less time trying to tear them down because we don't agree or we don't like it or whatever it is that causes you to tear them down, you know, we have a lot more people successful and a lot more happy people. Because if you're just tearing people down just for the heck of it, there's something wrong with you. Not that person, not them. If they are working to better themselves and striving to be better themselves, make a little extra income on the side, throwing it out there, putting themselves out there and getting out of their little comfort zone or their little recliner with their chair every day or whatever it is that's your comfort zone, then leave them alone. Let them be successful. Let them go for it. Why don't you jump on and do it too? You never know. The cool thing about where I'm at is that you can jump on board and way out make me. Because you did more. You tried harder. You talked to more people. You put yourself out there. You really got out of that comfort zone. So, is it, it's not where, I, just because I bring you in doesn't mean I make more. No, if you work harder, you make more. Hello? Unlike some jobs where you bust your butt and do everything you're supposed to in extra, extra hours, and you don't get nothing else for it? Not even a thank you or a pat on the back sometimes, depending on where you work? Hello, if you work harder, do more here, you're going to make more than me. Although I know I'm there, I know I'm out there, I'm putting myself out there, doesn't necessarily mean 
that I make more. I have an upline that's amazing. This woman has gone from one success to another. She's just amazing. Everybody wants her where they are at. Everybody just wants to be where she is. But she worked hard for many years to get there. And she's amazing. And I love her to death. And she makes me want to succeed because she makes me feel like I'm part of that team. So instead of beating somebody up because of what they do or what they feel success is or what they feel anything is, she back off. Share a post. Don't share the post. Jump on and join us. I mean, what do you got to lose? Go water for energy, anybody? Love you.